What's up guys, my name is Marcel Flores and you're watching my YouTube channel One Dapper Street where I talk about men's fashion and men's lifestyle on a weekly basis. Today's video is kind of a part two to the BTS, the back to school video that I uploaded a little while ago. Like this t-shirt for example, if you like this t-shirt or anything else that you see on the rack right here, make sure to check that video out right here and take a look at the 10 essentials that I would recommend you guys get before you head back to school. But today we're gonna focus on one of those a little bit more and that is backpacks. Like this one, this one, this one, this one, this one, this one, or this one. I've got seven brands for you guys that pop into my head when I think backpack. Now, two of them are gonna be in the designer price range, which I know might not be the most reasonable for a high school student or a college student, but I wanna mention them for one, out of aspirational purposes. You're like, oh my God, I want that backpack. Maybe you save up, maybe you get it because you love it. And two, because they're cool. I mean, I wanna talk about it because they deserve some talking about. When I talk about backpacks, I never really cared about functionality so much, nor did I about comfort. For me, it was primarily about fashion, about how good it looks. Of course, comfort is something that plays into it. And of course, I want to know that I can fit everything in there. But at the end of the day, I mostly care about what it looks like. And let's start with my favorite one. This backpack right here is from Coach. It's a full leather backpack. It's priced around $800. Go comments, go crazy. I know it's nuts, but it's a true leather backpack. I've had this for six years and it hasn't gone out of style. It's only gotten more beautiful, actually, the more it wears in. So yes, I know, solid start to the video, but it's my favorite backpack. So there you go. Oh, actually also got it in black. <coughs> $1,600 for two backpacks. <laughs> Now, a little bit more reasonable. Another brand that I always think of when I think backpacks is Herschel. This is one of my favorites of theirs. It's really large, it's got a padding on the back so it's comfortable and it's got some support regardless of what you've got inside of it. Call it a little bit of a hipster design with the leather straps across the back. It's similar to what I've got on my back right now but obviously way more affordable because this for one is not real leather and two, you've got the nylon as the main fabric of the backpack. I like it because you have a little bit of an extra pocket if you have small things like your wallet or an external charger. You can fit that up front but overall I just like the combination of the colors it's a cool backpack Herschel offers also a more simple version they also have more fun prints so whatever your vibe is Herschel's got you covered at a reasonable price range around a hundred dollars for this one for the more outdoorsy type we've got North Face North Face is a great company obviously it's a very strong brand you think outdoors you think hiking you think forest and woods I really like this one it's a simple black one you've got some space for a light jacket to fit in right up in the front it's got the extra chest support I really will actually buckle the front clip. I always like the way it looked when it's just dangling around, but it actually can help if the backpack's really heavy to support that a little bit. So there's a functionality to it. Obviously you fit water bottles on the side because once again, that's the outdoorsy one. So that's company number three that I wanted to mention and company number three that pops into my head when I think backpack. If you're more of the sporty type and this could actually even pass as kind of a designer backpack, this Adidas one, I think it almost has like an off-whitey aesthetic with the text right here nice and simple white and black i really like this the design is pretty cool and even the pulse ring has like a special design to it it's kind of got like a pyramid vibe going i really like this and adidas also is just one of the companies that i do think about when i think of backpacks because i feel like it's somewhat limited when i go back in time i have uh east pack and jansport those used to be the two big companies but i feel like those are a little bit outdated by now and i feel like there's more interesting things adidas is also a german brand that i personally really really like i grew up up with it obviously so this would be company number four now before we go all the way down low with the pricing we're gonna go all the way high up with the pricing with this Prada backpack it's a simple nylon backpack I actually was sent this by Prada thank you guys so much I'm not being paid to promote this right now they sent this to me as a present and I'm choosing to mention it because I think it's cool so the design is really limited to like the initials where you have leather patches in different colors obviously it's well constructed it, obviously it's real leather detailing the nylon is high quality at the end of the day it's the small things that make a difference with backpacks like this it's in the details that Prada can really differentiate itself from the competitors a big reason why I thought of Prada immediately is a backpack that I do not own that I'm absolutely in love with that's on the website right now combining a few different prints and two pockets and I think the design is absolutely beautiful so I brought the one in that I have at home but I wanted to show you guys the one from the website as well price point pretty steep but the next one's gonna change that. Quick side note, if you're feeling creative and you wanna recreate this, you absolutely can. It might not be the same exact quality that will last you for years and years, but if you feel like putting your own initials on the backpack or something, it would be a really fun thing to do, I personally think. So that's always an option that's a lot more cost effective.
magic. <laughs> now let's talk about the most affordable option, which is actually the one that I mentioned in the back to school video, which is this one from Urban Outfitters. It's $39. It's not real leather. If that's something you're concerned about, this backpack will have you covered. Great price point, great design, straightforward, easily combined with many things in the straight black, nice and grainy leather look. $39. Brand number six, Urban Outfitters. They actually have a few great options in terms of backpacks at a really reasonable price point. And last but not least, and last but not least, I am not a skater. I do have a skateboard branded for my own brand. I am using this a lot to get from A to B. I'm getting better at it right now. But once again, I am not a skater. If you are, Burton is a company that probably pops to mind. I'm a snowboarder, so Burton is on top of my mind also. I'm not entirely sure how this fits on here. I think I think you just kind of like put it in there, but it's got the two straps for the skateboard. I don't know if this is too big a skateboard or whether this is more so meant for like a penny board, but I really like the design of this backpack. It's straightforward, beautiful color, nice fabric. I actually read some of the online reviews and people are really really happy with the quality of this fabric and then I like the design of the straps but this is the last company that I wanted to mention and that's the video for today seven brands for backpacks that I hope sparked your imagination a little bit if you need a little bit more inspiration make sure to check out my Instagram account and follow me on there where I post a lot of my outfits also integrating these seven backpacks that I was talking about today that's it thank you guys so so much for watching let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section and as always make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on any of the videos coming up. I'll see you very soon with the next one and until then stay dapper. Bye.